They've been racing here since 1976. But today will mark the final Southwick National. And it is going to be a historic event for many reasons. Of course, the fans in the New England area, the NESC, New England Sports Committee, has been hosting motocross races since 1958, again, 76, the first time they ever raced at Southwick. But it's going away after today. In the 42 years of pro motocross in America, no track is as unique as Southwick. The sand has defined the racing, but the people define the track. The Legionnaires at post 338 have put on not just the national, but many local races for each of the past 37 years. Southwick is a labor of love for both the sport of motocross and the community at large. Southwick isn't just a race, it's a neighborhood gathering. This explains why all of the great riders to have come through the gates. No riders are created more warmly than the ones with local ties. Men like the great Doug Henry from nearby Oxford, Connecticut, who won here three times in the 90s. And of course, Chicopee, Massachusetts' John Dowd. The junkyard dog is immortalized on the track, not with a turn or obstacle in his name, but a doghouse bearing his famous moniker. Today, at the tender age of 47, Dowd, like the rest of the field, races Southwick for the final time in front of his people, his motocross family.